Hey guys, Dawn's here, back with her hair being a lot shorter, as you know, what, <laughs> you know, dealing with the heat and all that, and I am going to do some venting. One is something that has been uh, going on of late that I've been doing my little best not to get involved with, but I feel like I need to say something about what happened. During a video that a certain someone had been on escape the night twice, decided to upload and stir up a whole pot of drama. And that person is Gabby, Hannah, or however you pronounce the last name. I'm disappointed in her. She chose to cross a line and go after Joey, who had him in a podcast that someone had caused a lot of stress and tension during season four, but he respectfully never said who it was. But Gabby decided, I'm gonna stir up trouble. I'm even gonna play the victim. And I did not watch her video, but I get the gifts from others that she pretty much goes nuclear on everyone. Putting out all these lies, all these claims resulting in, well, pretty much what's been dubbed Escape the Knights of a War, breaking out. But I have a strong feeling most of those who have ever been involved with Escape the Night are siding with Joey and Daniel, and not with Gabby. As... <sighs> Playing a victim's card when there's no need to, that's just dumb. So I know what Rope tweeted on Twitter and I read that and Daniel did something similar and both he and Joey put out videos and expressing their disappointments and debunking the lies made by Gabby and I only watched Joey's I haven't watched anyone else's because I choose not to now, if you're dealing with mental issues or your health isn't top-notch don't take it out on the people around you. Get help. Gabby had been on season two of Escape the Night. She knew how busy doing that show can be. She knows how late you stay up to film two episodes a night or five nights. She knew this. She, when asked if she would like to come back, she said yes. She chose to come back. If she was having issues, she could have declined and gotten help. But no, she chose to go back on the show for a second time, only this time to be a complete diva and just make everyone end up hating her. The cast, the crew. I'm sorry, but that's just wrong. If you're having a bad day, you don't take it out on the rest of the world. And having had been, have had people do that to me in the past, I don't feel sorry for Gabby. I am disappointed in her 100% for choosing to hurt others just to think that it'll make her feel better. And trying this stupid stunt just to build up her numbers. Gabby, when your channel crashes and burns because you lose supporters, you lose subscribers, it's your own fault. No one else's. And I finally got that off my chest. It's been building up for a while. I know my friends on Discord have not been happy with Gabby either. <laughs> and real life current topic. I am on the river trail with my nephews and there's normally a park, a picnic bench with a table we would sit at, but someone has moved it so it's on the embankment at an angle where it's been rendered useless. Connor, Nathan, and I did try to move it, but it is too heavy and I end up falling on my bottom. I admit it. I fell and I wish people would quit putting the picnic tables where they can't be accessible for others. Hello, this is not someone's private property. This property, <laughs> everyone uses a river trail. 
and then every now and then someone's gonna want to set a picnic table to rest or eat. Oh, wow. Okay, put it down so it can dry, and once it's dry, we can put it in the bag. <laughs> Sorry, nephews. Uh, I'm just gonna go. So, I'll uh, post more stuff when I'm able to. I'm trying to do that more often. Still not a professional YouTuber, so I don't have any of the right gear. <laughs> and so, that's it for now. If you're new to my channel, hit the subscribe button, hit the notification bell so you get alert whenever I upload something new. And I will see you all later. Bye for now.